All right, I'm going to show you how to um, connect your Climax digital capture card to um, your Xbox or PS3 or anything uh, that it will work with. Uh, it's pretty simple once you've got the hang of it. And um, all the things I've got here I'll put a link to in the description. So first of all you're going to need the Climax digital itself, which is this thing, it's a USB, and it looks like this. And it's got the red, white and yellow. RCA inputs and then the um, S video which you're not going to need for this um, if, you're, if you've got one of these then take note that this button takes screenshots um, you need three splitters There's two female one male um, you need three of them gold preferably um, you're going to need a double sided RCA composite cable so it's just a this to the this and then um, you're going to need your normal standard definition Xbox cable or PS3 cable um, which goes into the Xbox okay so um, there is a quicker way but it's easier just to show you like this um, just if you're on HD um, plug in your composite cable your standard definition one straight into your TV so like this and um, let's go from there okay so you, if you're playing like this and you've got that all set up that's fine take your three cables out of your uh, TV and then get your splitters and plug them in okay so you've got your splitters in the cable leading to your Xbox um, it doesn't matter which way they go in or anything then you're going to want to grab um, the cable and stick it in the other end it's got to be on the same colours okay so you've got it going one cable going to your Xbox and one cable leading to this by the way with these if you um, buy them you can also get um, like yellow red and black this will be black but don't worry it's the same thing um, I, I do have a black one but I just uh, this one's shorter so I tend to use this uh, make sure you look at like um, if you're going to buy one. Make sure you look at the length of it because sometimes they're either really short and you need a long one, or you need a short one but they're really long and they're not quite expensive. Okay, so then um, grab your capture card um, and then plug the splitters into the capture card. Okay, so that's um, the splitters into the capture card. Notice that this um, S video is you just don't need it. You just leave it. Um, and then you got the USB. Get this cable, plug this into your TV. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. Okay, so that's in your TV. So basically, it's coming from your Xbox into your computer via the capture card and then into your TV as well. If you don't use the splitters, which you can do, um, you will only be able to um, see your screen on your PC. I shouldn't recommend because it's a bit of lag. Like you get a bit of lag, so like a split second, which when you're playing won't exactly help you a lot. So then grab the USB. Um, before you do this, you'll get an installation disk, um, which you'll need to install the software with. Um, so just grab the USB, plug it in. I can get it the right way around. Okay, there we go. And then go onto your PC. And there'll be a thing called ArcSoft Showbiz. Click on that. Okay, so this is what the program looks like. Um, this is just like a couple clips I've had on here just to show you. This is a Battlefield 3. Um, it's got like an edit thing where you can like kind of edit like cut things add some audio and what what not but I wouldn't recommend it um, and just go on capture and then you get this and then um, if you go to source 
you go to source it'll be USB 2861 device I don't know if it'll be different um, if it doesn't work just take the USB out and plug it back in and click refresh a couple times uh, make sure you have this on composite video not S video um, audio on USB audio device and uh, this online which will already be like that device settings you need to do this um, go on to video decoder and then the video standard NTSC433 and then you can just leave the rest uh, obviously you can change the brightness and whatever but just leave that then um, turn your Xbox on turn your TV on and there it is on the PC right now which um, you can make it full screen which will show you that's basically what you'll be playing on which is pretty decent it's almost the same size but obviously it's a bit narrower and lags as I say alright so change it to um, your standard uh, AV setting uh, switch my controller on okay this is uh, my network's down so um, then there you go um, I'll just show you then you go on here and then you just press capture just press capture there and then it'll be capturing and I'll just move around a bit and uh, you might notice that um, when you're playing um, I've noticed if I keep the sound on on both there's sort of like an echo because it's coming out of your TV and your PC so you might want to like mute the sound on your PC or something because it's quite annoying and then stop and then it will take you to the edit page and then your video will be here um, you, may you must make sure that you drag it into the thing that says drag and drop here and then you can click play and there it is playing uh, you can delete it edit effects cut it trim it whatever um, and then you go to produce and then create file you can also create DVD or upload to YouTube um, put it as uh, the type is file manufacture file format um, the format is AVI quality uh, high quality and then you can go on settings and change some of the settings um, but they're sort of the standard ones um, you can change that to what you want and then obviously browse and then put it wherever you want it to be saved I've got it in my videos and then just prick, um, press start and they're saving it'll take a while so you might have to leave it if you've got like a 10 minute video it might take about 10 minutes it usually takes about as long as the video is okay so it's finished um, successfully um, then you can just go into like some editing program and just um, uh, drag and drop it in if you've got any questions uh, leave it in the comments or um, uh, write me a message or Whatever, thanks for watching, please rate the video, and yeah, goodbye.